What's up guys? Welcome back. Today is October 1st. We love new months. We love fresh starts. Fall is here. I'm so excited. If you can tell by my sweater, cute. Such a fall sweater. This is from Unmarked. If I find the link, I will link it down below for you guys. Yeah, we are officially in spooky season. This year, a huge priority of mine is just getting into the spirit as soon as possible. We're starting off strong on the 1st of October. Later today, I'm going to go to Bath and Body Works and pick up some candles and lotions. I feel like scents is like the number one. It's like the first scent or no, no your five senses. It's your first scent. <laughs> scents? is the biggest fucking, do you know what I'm trying to say? The five senses, because you have smell, yeah. touch, you know, all right. that stuff, taste. Smelling is, in my opinion, the strongest, the most important of senses. Right. To get yourself into a yes. mood. The issue is that it's scent and sense. Scent and sense, that's the problem. That's definitely messing me up. Your, the, the priorities, <laughs> this, the priorities. <laughs> We wiped out our whiteboard, planned some things. This is going to be a crazy month, you guys. It is so exciting. Yesterday, I just got back from New York with Phineas. I just went for the weekend and it was insane. They performed SNL, which is so crazy. We went to go see, oh my gosh, we went to go see Harry Potter and the Cursed Child, which is a two-part play, and we banged it all out in one day. The magic that they did in that show. I was very skeptical about how they were going to sort of bring in the magic world on stage, because obviously it all has to be optical illusions and lighting and all these things, but they killed it. There were some things that happened that we just we still cannot find an explanation for. That was crazy, so we got back yesterday. I also filmed some content over the weekend. being a baby and stepping into it. So we're at the studios right now. This is the room. They just have rehearsals. I'm essentially just very slowly getting ready for the after party, which happens after the show. Yeah! Phineas, your boobs are out. Why don't you have your boobs out? You're showing your nipples. <laughs> Phineas' portion of getting ready. <laughs> Another 40 seconds. A solid, yeah, 40 more seconds. We're also just petting some farm animals because one of the skits had a donkey and a sheep and a goat and they were so cute. I haven't done this in a long time, but I'm feeling it today. Do you go up or down? <laughs> no. Right? Hello. How's makeup on? Good. Am I interrupting the vlog? No, it's okay. I have more makeup on than her. That's impossible. Is it? It is impossible. Hey, Claudia, how are you? <laughs> nice video, see ya. <laughs> well, that's gonna go in. <laughs> Ooh. I think, I think we're done. Dumplings. Someone surprised us with little, little dumplings. They're green. They are green. What's in there? I don't know, I hope, I hope not shrimp. Oh. It doesn't look like shrimp, does it? No. Looks like veggies. It's Looks like basic. carrot and like onion or something. Oh no. Mm. It's vegan, right? Mm hmm. Tastes very vegan. A quick change. Here's tonight's outfit. The top and suit pants are both from Reformation. And then I've got these cute black strappy heels. I originally wanted to wear these. I feel like they're a lot more kind of fancy looking and kind of match with the white, but I fear that they're gonna hurt my pinky toes because I have very wide feet. He is looking dapper, handsome. Who, me? The rings, the double rings. <laughs> you look great. Next week, Manny and I are taking a little trip together with Revolve. It's gonna be so fun. We're going to Napa. And then also, I mean, this month is, this month is crazy. I'll say one thing. We're moving. 
<laughs> I've been sort of hinting towards it. You know what? I mean, yeah, I've been actually I haven't even been hinting towards it. It's been very clear from the escrow post. <laughs> when I said high five, we're in escrow. Yeah. We're moving this month, so it's gonna be a really exciting month. I love moving vlogs. This will probably be the last bulk of moving vlogs for a very long time because the decisions that we're making and the changes we're making are a little more permanent. Yeah, basically just wanted to let you guys know that I'm going to buy some candles today. I'm really stoked about it. So I'm gonna get back to editing. Yeah, that's, that's where we're at. Happy October, everyone. I am so excited. Do you like? October. Dude, I'm so stoked. <laughs> I love October. I, love I October. knew you were an October girl. Just opened up all of the pieces for next week's revolve trip and I'm so excited because right now they have so many cute little kitten heels. Look at this heel. How freaking adorable. And I love the crocodile skin. Love this color, this pattern, tie-dye. So excited to wear this shirt. I just feel like everything is kind of fall feeling as far as like the color palette. Oh my gosh, this freaking belt. Are you kidding me? Beautiful, stunning, can't wait. I've also decided this is my favorite style and shape for their girlfriend denim jeans, which is one of my favorite jean brands and they just fit so well. I will put up a photo on the screen, but they're high-waisted and sort of straight-legged and just, I don't know, there's something about them that's so perfect. This style is called Mika the Mika. Incredible fitting. I will link this down below. Sort of new thing in my life. Lately, I have been taking BioK. I just want to know if any of you guys have tried this stuff. It's basically just like a great way to get probiotics into your system. There's 50 billion cultures. This is this is not me promoting something that you should take, but I just want to ask if any of you guys enjoy BioK. Phineas doesn't like this stuff. He says it's really gross, but the flavor that I have found to like is the fermented rice probiotic in blueberry just got a package and I'm pretty sure I know what this is I'm so excited every so often I go on the real real and just you know check out what's what's happening oh, yes yes not sponsored bought this with my own money but I knew that they were having like a 20% off sale oh my god whoa I love the freaking style of it. Oh my God. We've been in here for five minutes and my nose already has become desensitized yeah, we're from everything. Up like, a, like a fucking headache. <laughs> I know, everything kind of smells the same. I'm very overwhelmed. I've decided that my strategy this year is getting the smaller- Are you going to with me after this? Huh? <laughs> What'd you say? Are you going to hot dog gonna stick with me after this? It's not a joke. Wait, you actually want that? Yeah, we're in a mall. I'm in a mall exactly one time a year. <laughs> I got really confused because you're vegan. I am. I'm not gonna get a hot dog. They have tofu dogs on the stick. Do they really? They do. Do you not have one? No. They're really good. I've never heard you talk about this ever. <laughs> Well, Anyways, maybe because I, I haven't been in a mall. Yeah, because you haven't been in a mall. In We've, a year. We just celebrated our one year anniversary, which means my annual mall visit. <laughs> this just, is so true. Literally, this time you, last year, you went to Bath and Body Works. Yeah. The approach and strategy that I'm using this year is um, I always fall into getting the three wick candles, which are like the bigger size. It takes me forever. <laughs> I'll never get through this. <laughs> what, what is this? I know, I know this is really sweet. This smells really good. What is it? it? Smells like pumpkin peanut. Fruit. Not bad. Get it if you like it. Claudia loves it. <laughs> Can you tell? It takes me forever to burn through these big ones, so I am just going to be getting the single wick ones this year, and I'd rather get more scents and smaller sizes, you know. So that is the strategy. Look at how many damn candles are in this store. This is very overwhelming. This is so aggressive. Yes, you will. I love those. Love you. you best believe we're gonna be doing a candle and body lotion haul at some point tonight. We're gonna go meet up with the family to CVS to get flu shots. Yeah, family that gets flu shots together does not get the flu together. <laughs> That's, That's right. Catchy motto. Guys, I am feeling this new bag. Oh, my, oh, look at that. Oh my God. The camera should really be looking in your face, honestly. I don't know where my car went. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I think I might see it. You think you see it? Yeah. Maybe, I'm driving a white Prius. What are the odds that it's my white <gasps> I think I see it too. That's what I saw. Oh, oh. Mom walking through a mall, mother of three walking through a mall. That's the step she's doing. 
Mother of three about to get a Subway sandwich employee fired. Yes! Everything's perfect. It's getting hot in here, so take off all your clothes. Like, upper arm like that. Nipple. A little nipple right there. Nipple. You see a little nipple. <laughs> Howdy, you're up. Good right. boy. You're up, lady. Coming over now. Yeah, but they're not going to see it. It's all dark. I'm just going to hold this face. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I realized that I never showed you guys what we got from Bath and Body Works last night. I left Phineas's choices at his house, so I can't show those. He got like a hot cocoa scented candle, smells amazing. He got like a relaxation one and one that's called Love that was rose and vanilla. So freaking cute. And he also loved it so much he got it in a lotion. What a man. I mean, truly. I got some lotion. I got the Aromatherapy Peaceful Tea Tree and Peppermint Lotion. Just needed some new body lotion, and I like the smell of this. And then I got four candles. And like I said, I got the single wick ones because it takes me forever to burn through the three wick ones. We had to get leaves, of course. So I got this little guy. Crisp red apple, golden nectar, warm clove spice. Hands down, the most folly fall candle of all fall candles. Everyone needs to talk about this candle and for very good reason. Also last night I was burning chestnut and clove. This packaging is so cute. It looks like little wood panels. This one's a little more subtle. Warm roasted chestnut, fresh ground clove, and cedar wood. I was gonna say it smells like wood. Woody, <laughs> it smells woody. I got marshmallow fireside, which is toasted marshmallow, smoldering woods, fire roasted vanilla. And when it burns, it just smells so good. One last candle, which isn't really in the season and I'll probably hold off on it, but I just feel like this is such a good new house candle like to burn in the kitchen. It's white gardenia. Love the packaging of this one. So it just says white gardenia, apple water, white woods with essential oils. It smells like hydrangeas Literally too. Literally my like, favorite scent in the whole world. That smells so good. I want a perfume in this. 